rocks not only give you lot of things but it also tells you about lot of things and today we are going to learn about such rocks and minerals in particularly we will be talking about kinds of rocks and minerals what are rocks made up of rocks are made up of minerals minerals are natural non living substances rocks may contain one or more minerals there are three categories of rocks the rocks on the earth's crust are divided into these three categories which are they igneous rocks sedimentary rocks and metamorphic rocks what are igneous rocks the solid rocks formed when the magma cools after being pushed upward towards the surface of the earth they are not they are also known as fiery rocks okay magma the molten material formed when the rocks deep inside the earth melt due to extremely high temperature what is this can you identify yes correct this is an volcanic eruption well this hot material is pushed upward by the pressure of other rocks what is lava the magma which rushes out through the cracks on the crust or from a volcano then igneous rocks are further divided based on how magma cools so it can be either granite basalt obsidian or pumice so these are the four categories of the igneous rocks let us see one by one first one granite formed when magma cools slowly under the earth's crust it is very hard and has large grains it contains three minerals namely feldspar quartz or mica it can be white red pink or black in color so this was the information regarding granite it is used in constructing buildings and statues because of its hardness it is very hard so it can be used to build different buildings and statues pumice formed when the frothy lava cools quickly on the earth surface it looks like a sponge with the holes and pockets it looks is due to the gases that get trapped when the rock cools it is light in color it is used as a scrubber and to polish furniture and floors so this is pumice all the information about pumice what is pumice first of all the frothy lava that cools on the earth surface quickly forms the pumice it is light in color and it can be used as a scrubber to polish furniture and floors then comes obsidian obsidian is found when the magma cools down quickly it is dark in color it is glassy and sometimes also colorful it forms sharp edges on breaking it was used by ancient human to make tools so this was information about obsidian all these are types of igneous rocks well students that was all for today thanks for attending this session if you have any doubt feel free to ask me you can put your comments in comment box in the next session we will be studying more topics from the chapter rocks and minerals so until then take care bye bye